Once you have logged in to JBI Paces, you will enter the dashboard. To create a project in JBI Paces, you click on this Create Project button that appears in the top right-hand corner. And this takes you through to the project dashboard, where in the project title box, you can enter the title for your evidence implementation project. So in this example, I'm going to write Central Venus Access Device. And I'm actually interested in the insertion of the Central Venus Access Device. And um, this is the title for my implementation project that I'm planning to undertake. The next thing you need to do is to select your audit criteria for your project. You do this by clicking on the Add Criteria button. To find the audit criteria that are linked to a JBI evidence summary, type your keywords into the search box. Um, and because I'm interested here in Central Venus Access Device, I can just type in Central Venus. And then I click on the search button here. This will load all the audit criteria results that are linked to Central Venus and you can see them here. Then I'm able to show or hide the audit criteria that are linked by clicking on this um, audit criteria by clicking on the blue drop down arrow to the right hand side. And then I can view the individual audit criteria for this topic which I can select for use in my project by selecting here on the individual checkbox, if I'm interested just in that one, or if I want to select all the audit criteria that are linked to an evidence summary, I can select here the checkbox at the top. Importantly, I also want to be able to view the JBI evidence summary, and I can do that by clicking here on the information button. This will highlight the actual recommended practice that is linked to the audit criteria. And I can also view the full evidence summary by clicking on this link, which will take me through to the full version of the evidence summary, which highlights the evidence base which supports your implementation project. I'm also able to create my own custom criteria if I want that for my project by clicking here on create custom criteria. In the pop-up window that opens, you're able to select the type of answer, whether it's Boolean, whether it's range data, um, numerical data, or checkboxes, either multiple checkboxes or a single checkbox. It's also optional to be able to provide a source link that links the evidence to your informed custom criteria. Once you've created custom criteria, they will appear here on the right hand side with the other audit criteria that you've selected for your project. And then you would click on continue. And this will load the audit criteria that if you have selected for your, for your project. You're also able then to hover over the icons to the right. You can delete the audit criteria with this bin icon. You're able to edit the audit criteria with this pencil icon. And you are also able to add information into an audit guide to provide guidance to the data collectors for your project. Be sure then to scroll to the bottom and click on next.